is up, ladies and gentlemen of the tubes? Today we are back in Livonia, and we are going to do a little bit of fishing. So, <clears throat> find me a good spot here. Uh, the character we were playing as got killed. Uh, hence why we are now a Asian female. And, uh, yeah. So... <laughs> we, uh, like a dumbass, we went to the air, the airfield, and, um, there are so many more zombies, just so many more zombies in, uh, in Livonia, it's, it's just insane how many there are, and we got swamped with zombies, now we dealt with them, we dealt with, with a large majority of them, unfortunately, all it takes is one, and for you to not have any rags to bandage. So we bled out while running around. Now you're probably asking, why didn't you take off your shirt or your pants and cut them into rags? Well, they were ruined. So therefore, a little bit of lag. So you can't cut them into rags. So we were fucked. But we're back. And we're surviving. And we're doing pretty good. I'm not finding loot a whole... Like, uh, I'm not finding loot a, a big issue here. Um... But, uh, we've got this nice new BK-43 double-barreled shotgun. Look at this thing. Oh, it looks so sweet. Oh, I can't wait to use it. And we are loaded for bear. Quite literally. Is that a mushroom? Are mushrooms still a thing? I'm sure they are. I don't know. I haven't seen any mushrooms or fruit. Uh, I think we're going to fish right here. Nice, nice little secluded spot. Pull out our fishing rod. We've already got our hooks and everything. Now, guys, um, I'm, I know other YouTubers have covered this. I'm sure you're sick of hearing it. But when you make the fishing rod, before you can put the hook on the rod, you have to put the worm on the hook and then combine the fishing rod with the hook. In any case, um, let's fish. Wow, you didn't cast very far. But, and did we get anything? Did we get anything? Nope. And basically, we just sit here and wait until we get a fish. So, uh, I, I found that this is probably the most... I don't know, this and finding chicken is so far the best way that I can get food. Now, I think in a later video, because there's quite a sizable forest behind me, I think I may do a hunting video... I'm not sure how many animals are in the forest behind me here. It is quite... There we go. There we go. Did we get a fish? Did we get a fish? Oh, we did. We got... We got... Yeah, look at that. Okay, let's let's put that away. Let's take our carp. Look at that thing. Okay. Do we have something to cut it up with? Nope, that's ruined. Gut and prepare. Our machete is almost ruined, so we're going to, and our knife is definitely ruined. Um, so from one fish, we get two fillets. So, and I do not have enough inventory. You know what? Let's get rid of the ammo there. These shoes are pristine, I think. What are these? These are pristine. I, I want a second pair of shoes on me. Um... I guess I don't really need the flashlight. I don't know, did it come with a battery in it? It didn't, so it's useless to me for right now. Um, what ammo is this? 380 ACP. We have a lot of that. Let's drop some of that. Don't really care about the handcuffs. Don't need the blood collection kit. I am going to keep the nails just in case I need um, this. We can move up there. What is this? I know I'm going to regret dropping the Scorpion Mag, but we're going to drop that. Just clearing out some space. Definitely don't want to drop the Tetracycline. Um, okay, so we'll take that. And we will get our fishing rod back out. We need to eat something soon. So, take that. And... Uh, take... Oh, 
Oh, you know what? Now let's drop that for a second. Drop the fishing rod. Put the hooky in her hand. And the worm. Combine. Craft fishing bait. Okay, so now that we have the fishing bait, that goes... We get our fishing rod out and combine it and we are ready to fish yet again. And then I'm going to start a fire, get this all cooked up. Guys, I am loving Livonia. The only thing I'm not loving about it is all the zombies. Um, wow, there it's, it's a challenge. You're moving through a high pop area, uh, a dense, dense little town. You get three of them on you, and you start to run from them, and you're just attracting more, and more, and more until you, before you realize you got fifteen or twenty of them behind you. Uh, it's it's, it's uh, the zombie struggle is real in Livonia. Uh, man, all right, another fish. What I like about the fish is you can take it with you and prepare it later. So, it's six slots though. How much are the fillets? Let's look at that. They are six each as well. Wow. It's almost more economical to take the fish with you. Okay. I wonder if we could cook the fish whole. Alright. Let's, let's pull out our machete. You know what? Put the machete away. And, uh... We, do we have gloves on? We, we do. Okay. We can break bushes with our hands. Cut bush. So now we can make sticks with our hands. Not sure if this is going to make me bleed. Or ruin... It'll probably ruin my gloves, honestly. Um, so, what did I get from that? I got short stick. Which I can't put in my... Damn, I have like no inventory at all. What can I get rid of? Um, I don't want to just drink this this mad monkey for no reason. I definitely don't want to get rid of my fishing rod. Um, damn. Okay. Let's drop that. I guess we're just going to make the fire right here. I need a hand drill, too. Now my machete is badly damaged. Okay. Okay. So, put that away. We'll come over here and get our short stick in hand. Come over here. Oh, okay, guys. Combine. Craft fireplace. Put it right there. This is Livonia survival. Um, I've never had to do any of this in... Okay, so there's our fireplace. So we are going to take this bark and I'm putting it in here for the fuels and then all right that is going to be used I need another bush cut bush so I can get another short stick and make a hand drill Now we can split sticks over our knee. There we go. 
Okay. So, come over here. Make Kandro kit. I don't think anybody's going to see our fire out here. We're like on the other side of the lake. Okay. So now I just want to add these sticks to this. There we go. Pick up the hand drill. And uh, you know what? Before I do that, let me come back. Where did I cut that other bush? Right here? Yes. Let's get our fish on here. You know what? Let me see something real quick. Can I cook that whole fish? No. You have to prepare it. Okay. So we'll drop that. Andrew. Ignite. There we go. Roast that sucker. It'd be really cool if while cooking the meat, it would attract bears. I was thinking how cool would that be if you actually had, if you had food on you, like open open uh, cans of beans or spaghetti or something like that or the tactical bacon or you know you were cooking the fish or walking around with it or, or chicken or, or whatever uh, the smell would actually attract bear because um, that would make cooking a real danger unless you were obviously inside of some sort of structure so that fish is cooked put that in our inventory uh, we'll take our other yeah, we'll do the chicken right now. I just want to get as many cooked as I can right now. Because as you can see, my food is in the yellow. And th this has pretty much been a struggle uh, since I've jumped on Livonia. Just uh, no real time to go go explore or, uh, or even PvP. Just because you're too busy surviving. You, you don't have the, the energy. Um... And as a result, I've actually run into, like, more friendly players. Because um, they just don't want to waste their energy fighting it out or, or getting killed and, and having to start all over. It's, it's a real bitch to have to start all over again. So, um, the players I have met have not been interested in any of that. That chicken's cooked. Get this one on the fire right now. Then maybe we'll walk off into this woods and explore it a little bit after I eat. Man, I lost so much loot on my other character, though. Um, I had, like, three guns. I got three guns now, but... Uh, I had nothing crazy. I had an M-Lock pistol with a clip. Two clips. Uh, an SK-59, which, you know, is as common as dirt. And, uh... A couple of the uh, KAM mags. Put that in inventory. Alright. Oh my god, we have a lot of chicken, don't we? We are good on food. That's for sure. I don't want to cook too much of this meat. I'm going to eat some of it though. Yeah, maybe I will cook it all. But it actually, if you put too much hot meat on your character, it makes your temperature go up, and it, it will affect your health. Um, it'll also help you in a cold situation, though, as well. So if it's if it's rainy, you're cold, you don't want to hang out by your fire, you want to get moving, um, you can cook a bunch of meat, put it on your character, and it'll act as a, a warming pack and keep you warm. Which is really useful so that's cooked uh, I want to get all this meat cooked meat spoils so 
this fire is almost out. The server will restart in 30 minutes. I just got on. I guess I'm going to make a short video here. It's not an entirely exciting video. I didn't think it would be. I just wanted to show you guys the fishing mechanic and <sighs> how my character is faring. I did have the hockey mask on before, so with the yellow raincoat, I look like uh, Hannibal Lecter and uh, Georgie from It had a love child. But guys, uh, let me know in the comments below. How are you liking Livonia? Are you finding it a struggle to stay alive? Are you making it out there? Are you running into more friendly people, more hostile people? What's going on? Give me your Livonia stories in the comments below. I'm gonna cook up this last piece of chicken and then we are out, skis. But yeah, when I went to that military base, I guess I guess they're gonna try to keep airstrips a staple of uh, of DayZ. Um, I did find quite a few uh, remnants of dead people there, including human steak cut up on the floor. So that made me a little nervous. But I actually didn't run into anyone there. So the sun is setting. We want to get back to civilization. Actually, I don't really want to be out here in the woods. All right, so let's let's just drop that long stick. We don't need that, and let's eat two of these right away. Eat another one right out the gate. This forest is uh, very foreboding. And I think I want to head back the way we came. So I can check this out another time. I'm wrestling with the idea, do I want to eat more and fill my food meter or save it for later? So I'm not really sure. But we'll get back to our little... I think we can make it back to our quote-unquote uh, base. We're not, we're not really, we haven't done any base building yet, but I've, I've found like a nice little area that I want to hang out in for a while at least until I get my, my gear up, I guess, or until I get a little more brave to leave the area. We'll eat one of those fish too. That's about half our food. So we have another half. So we'll eat more of this. Good thing is we found tetracycline. So if we do get sick, if need be, if we have to drink this poop water, we're safe. One thing they definitely fixed is uh, my the hydration meter um, has been full for a while for a while now um, it has not gone down uh, I have had my hydration meter full for two in-game days um, while running around and uh, it has not gone down and I don't think it's there my food meters full and it's not a bug. Um, they have just fixed it. Uh, a lot of people were complaining that in the past the hydration meter was going down too fast. That uh, no no person dehydrates that quick. So they had fixed they had fixed that issue, which I'm glad. Now the food meter drops a little. What is that over there? Is that a boat? Can I get... That is a boat. I'd like to go over there and see that boat. Perhaps it has netting. I need netting. I'd also like to avoid the undead. So... We'll check out this boat. We'll come back this way. 
Is it a boat? It is a boat. Is there netting by it? But sadly, there is not. Let's go back this way. Actually, I'm just going to cut up the town. That's another thing. You don't really want to be sprinting anymore. You don't want to be doing any of that. Like, conserving your energy is important. Okay, okay there's the bridge. There's the bridge. Alright, we found our way back. That's what I want to cross. And I basically circumnavigated all those zombies in that town. I need to find another knife. Got it, or a machete, uh, any anything, anything that I can cut with. I know I can. I know I can use the machete as a weapon still after after it's ruined, but for making rags, uh, cutting up chicken, anything like that. understand this. Why can I not get in this? This car has car parts, but I can't open the door to get in? Like, I can take the car door, but I can't get in. Okay. I found another car like that, too. And, and that one, admittedly, looks way more beat up. But the other one kind of confused me, because I was like, this, this car looks brand new. It looks like a car that you should have been able to get into. And just in case you guys are wondering where I'm at. For all you stream snipers out there. For uh, hunters of men. I've been in this tent like four times. There's nothing in here. But I know shit will spawn in here. Zombies seem to be more prevalent at night as well. Let's, uh, let's see if I can see. Anything in here? A car battery. Don't really need that. Not yet, anyway. Not yet. I did find some shit in here before. What is this? Denim shorts. Don't need that. A tracksuit. else. Alright guys, I don't want to make this video too long because this isn't exactly the most exciting video, but I think in my next video we're going to do a hunting video. I don't know how exciting that's going to be, but again, hit that like button guys, that always helps me out. Hit that subscribe button and I'll catch you in the next one. Peace. Okay guys, so literally as I was ending my video, um, I started to hear some footsteps around my little trailer park home so this is what transpired i am not a nice person